Hello guys and welcome back to another Fallout 4 mod spotlight video. This time we're going to be taking a look at BHPPSH41 submachine gun made by Bruderhood. <laughs> yes, nice name by the way. This is also why the BH is in the beginning by the way. Um, but anyway, what this mod does is it adds the PPSH41 into the game. Um, which is a very unique weapon used during World War II of course. Uh, now, uh, the, the weapon contains a couple of it, uh, well, a lot of attachments actually. And it has a lot of optional files uh, that might uh, support your uh, favorite like weapon mods, like tactical reload and, and stuff like that. So if you want any of that stuff, then it does support that as optional downloads. What a beauty. A fun fact, this is actually my favorite weapon from World War II. And, and ever actually, I really like the PPSH for some reason, I don't know why. Playing World at War, Call of Duty World at War. Um, anyway, let's take a look at how this gun shoots really fast. And of course, a beautiful reload animation as well. And like the PPSH is supposed to be like, it is a very fast shooting gun that wastes a lot of ammo. So you better have a lot of ammo on hand if you use this gun. Um, now, it also is supposedly, uh, it, it's similar to the Thompson, where it's, it's pretty much a shoot-a-lot gun with a round mag. But in any case, uh, if you want to get this gun, you can either craft it at the camp station right here, where you also craft the ammo for it. Or you can go ahead and just uh, find it on enemies uh, after you reach level 20, in case you guys are wondering, indeed, how to get the weapon. Now, the weapon has a couple of attachments, like I said. Uh, all the typical attachments you would find on weapons are here. The ones where you can add automatic uh, fire and, and single fire, of course. But single fire is less fire rate, but uh, essentially more damage and accuracy. And automatic is more damage over time, of course, uh, with fast fire rate. Then, of course, we have the look of the weapon, the barrel, I suppose. I like how they, it has the aftermarket there. It's kind of cool. Didn't even know there was something like that. And here we have all the different sights. I'm not going to mess with these sights because I don't know what they're used for. Like, I, I'm not a gun nut. I, 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 I don't have any real knowledge of guns besides video games. I don't really know what is uh, what is good and what is not. But again, I like the normal look of the gun. I'm going to add a drum make because the, the uh, PBSH-41 without a drum make is a bit disappointing. And here we have the different looks of the stocks in case you have a different taste. And you can add the damage if you think it's too weak. You can make it, f of course, you can make the more damage in percentage. So it's kind of cool. Now, the, the legendary one is a mod I have. So that's not part of the actual gun mod. But still very cool attachments you can, you can uh, apply to the weapon. And uh, very good modifications, I guess I should say. Let's just make it automatically hardened. I'm not going to use single fire. Are you crazy? On a PBSA single firing? Ah, that's that's just... It's not made for that. There's a reason why it has a... Uh, has this kind of barrel here. And of course, let's look at the round mag animation here. Or the reload animation for this one. As Very sweet as well. Well, I really like the, uh, the reload animations on these weapons. It's like one of the highlights for me. It's like... How do they make these good animations? These smooth animations? But yeah, it's just a solid weapon. Now, if the weapon is too loud or there is something you don't really like about the weapon, you could ask the mod author, the author to like release a um, an optional file to adjust that. As an example, um, a lot of people complain about the loud sound of the gun. So the mo mod author was like, okay, I'm going to release a, uh, a lower audio version of the weapon. And that is exactly what they did. So if you do dislike the loudness of the weapon or the PPSH, you can go ahead and just kind of lower it with that optional file. So no worries there. But uh, yeah, I guess that's kind of all there is to this mod. Uh, I do like it. It's pretty good. Uh, I, I think it's, it's, a, it's a nice implementation of the, the PPSH. And I really think it's going to stay in my load order just because I flip and love this gun. But yeah, that is also going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoy. Actually, before I leave, I'm just going to show you guys how it looks like if you run with it. And of course, if you walk with it here. I do wish the running animation showed the gun more. I don't know if that's just me messing it up or something that's doing that. In any case, nice weapon mod. I like it. And I'm definitely going to keep this in my load order. I yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, consider liking, subscribing, and sharing. Hope to see you in another one of my Mod Spotlight videos. 
Uh, the link to the actual mod is in the description down below in case you do want to check it out and add it to your game. And as always, uh, stay awesome.